Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to The Walking Dead. Let's play. David? Oh. What are you doing? That's uh, David. Um, don't do anything rash. That's a long way down. You'll fall fast, but you'll fall all the same. Come over here. Or are you afraid of me too? I'm... All the rest of them are. Right? I'm afraid of heights. I'm a lot more afraid of falling. And I'm even more afraid of landing. There's nothing to be afraid of. It'd be over in an instant. Who's... My wife, Javi. My son. He's thinking they of doing it? look at me differently. Maybe you're seeing them differently. I want to show you something. Stand with me. Uh, 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 fuck. Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea. Balls. Huh. Why the hell are you smiling? Yeah. See that sewer line over there? Perfect placement for a trench. That hill about a hundred paces west of it. Sniper's wildest dream come true. I'm a soldier, Javi. I see this landscape like a painter sees a blank canvas. Like how you used to see a baseball diamond. I'm a soldier. This makes sense to me. I, I was made for this. I, I think... I thrive in this. It makes sense, I guess. Maybe it's crazy. But sometimes crazy things make sense. If only a little. I'm surprised you understand. I do actually get that. A soldier isn't a husband. Or a father. A soldier is a soldier. I, I don't know if I buy that. Nothing else. Nothing. Nothing at all. I don't buy it. I don't quite buy it. Maybe you're a soldier now. But you were a son once. That was... A long time ago. Maybe too long. I want to change, Javi. I always have. Really? All you ever tried to do was get me to change. <sighs> Only because I couldn't bring myself to do it first. It's the one war I could never win. And I'm wondering why. Is it because I don't know how? Or because it's impossible to change who you really are? You don't need to, maybe you can't. Uh, there's always a way. There's a way. There always is. No matter how lost you are. You just have to keep looking until you find it. Looks pretty messy. For now. Maybe you're right. Maybe. Just gotta live long enough to find out. Just like with anything else. I did what you asked. You did. Thanks for that. So now, will you step back? Sure. I found them! They're up here! What's it? Did you read the text for the Yeah, 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 I'll have to check that out. Ran into... She was still outside when we checked on the entrances. There are muertos everywhere. We got her inside just in time. Seriously, I've never seen so many muertos. Um. It's awful out there. That was the right thing to do. Proud of you, buddy. Ava, uh, about earlier. I guess I owe you an explanation about <laughs> what happened on the stage. Yeah, I knew Trip you better than trip. you. That's... You don't have to say anything to me. Your actions said plenty. I read you loud and clear. But go ahead and say whatever you want. Hey, don't get mad at me. It was a total no win scenario. Just be glad the situation was what it was. And that she didn't make me pick between you and your brother. Well, obviously There's I wanted so Trip to live. I knew him better. They're pouring in. You don't know the half of it. The herd has taken over Richmond. The streets are filled with walkers. With that hole in the wall, this city is fucked. We're not safe here. No one is. Jesus Christ. 
So what do we do? I don't want to die up here. None of us do, Gabe. Um, we take, take it. out each and every one of them. Kill them before they kill us. I saw construction vehicles when we got that truck. Bulldozers and stuff. What if we use one of those to just, I don't know, run the muertos over? That's over by the motor pool at the water tower. Doesn't seem like a bad idea. We could use the highway overpass to get to the water tower. Come on. Let's jump. Come on. It's an easy jump. Oh, somebody's not going to make this jump. We had a jump scenario in in season one. Uh, oh no, okay, I guess we're good. Keep your eyes open. Stay aware of your surroundings. All of you. Let's move out. When we found Kate earlier, she walked right past me. Like she didn't even know who I was. Right past me and right towards you. Why was that? Uh, Just wondering. You're seeing things. Um, I don't know what you're talking about, man. You're seeing things. Yeah. I guess it was pretty crazy out there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to leave it as that. <laughs> By the way, uh, Javi, uh, that easy jump is the funniest death scene ever. <laughs> oh, if, if I screw that up, it's funny. Oh, shit. Oh, I bet that's one of the developers of the game getting eaten. We need to be careful up here, or else the exact same thing will happen to us. Stay sharp, and do not fire your guns. We're gonna be fine. That guy was all alone. We're not. What's that? The game is called A Way Out. Motherfucking couch split screen is back. Nice. Nice. Good to have split screen. Need split screen. Everyone hold back. Let Javi and I clear out these walkers. Yes. Agreed. Time to go. Time to go full Negan. Good to go. Let's move. If Clementine dies, I'm going to become an alcoholic. I swear. <laughs> you okay, bud? Hmm. He's not okay. When I was little, Dad used to ask me what I wanted to be when I was a man. And I pointed him. He always liked that. I thought he was such a great guy. It would always make him smile. Every time. David may not be perfect, but he's not the worst role model in the world. Maybe. Good. Never be like your uncle. He told me that all the time. Don't be a man who relies on other people to solve your problems. Because then you're not a man at all. I used to think he was right. Not anymore, though, Javi. I can only hope I grow up to be like you. So, <laughs> he said that? Going. I just... Dad said that. It's pretty shitty. He was wrong. You know that. And so do I. He took such good care of me. Now we need to take care of Dad. He's the one that needs our help. Yeah. What's that? The guy the guy who just got eaten was the guy who threw the Molotov cocktail cake? Oh! Oh! Good. You're gonna have to go around the side. Suck it, Mr. Molotov. There's barely any room. Time to waste. Come on. You know, I didn't think there was much that could oh. scare me anymore. That creaking. Yet, here we are. Just goes to show you. We're going it's we're not so bad. Full of this isn't that bad. I believe in you guys. Stop listening. Can do this. Oh, and it's my turn now. It's, it's going to be bad. And it's gonna go wee wee, and it's gonna push me. Yep. Here. Fuck off. 
think, I think I'm hearing some audio issues. Like the music's not cueing properly or something. You've got to be more careful. Oh! Ah! Holy shit! Oh my god! Ava! Fuck! God damn it! And no. Ava's gone. It happened so fast. I was gonna die. She saved my life, David. She would do it again, too. Let's keep going. Ava would kick my ass if she knew I was sitting around crying. Holy shit, dude, just just like that, gone. Well, this is um We have to get across. How do we get across? The fuck? Oh he shoot, he was just pulling him in. But David really is trying to look out for him. He's not doing the best job, but no one gives you a rule book to raise a kid. <laughs> sure as shit don't. No work. shit. Just one thing I don't get though. Did David really think he was helping AJ by letting him go? Why did he stop guarding him? Maybe. Ask him. Maybe you should ask him that. It might be that he just didn't care. Not everyone's like you, Clem. Not everyone wants to take care of a baby. I guess not, but after you put in all that work, so much of your heart... AJ was a brat. He lived with me after we kicked you out, Clem. I'd already raised two kids. Ought to be a piece of cake. <laughs> not with that tyrant. Is that why you gave him away? We had a bad winter. Destroyed every crop we had. I couldn't leave Richmond. And AJ couldn't stay in Richmond. I gave AJ to Lingard and told him to do whatever he had to to save his life. Hmm. I miss that, Brad. Never asked Lingard about it again. Though I wanted to. He, Often. He must miss you. I'll bet the little Brad misses you too. Both of you. It wasn't easy, Clem. Remember, as far as I knew, I'd already lost two children. It wasn't any easier with number three. It's never easy. I'm gonna keep you alive. Keep all of us alive. And hope that that's enough. Enough for atonement. He was your responsibility, no matter what. I thought it was best. You thought wrong. Yeah. Maybe I did. Hmm. Yeah, I think it's good that they hash that out. I gotta find out how to turn off notifications. But still, somehow, still, I don't know. Then I won't know if I'm being invited to Mortal Kombat or not. Holy shit. Chopped right in half. Oh. Okay, let's look at it. What the hell happened here? I, yeah, you want to believe I'm not cro uh, walking across that fucking thing. There's the other half. Ah. <laughs> oh, jeez. Gra Are you fucking kidding me? I'm supposed to... No, I, there's got to be something else for me to grab. No way we're jumping across that. Eh, yeah, he's right about that. I think, uh... I think the little... Halfling there is going to be a problem. <laughs> Came right to me. <laughs> How much weight can that take? You're not thinking it's that or go back. But how does the last guy get across? We should go lightest to heaviest. That way it won't break on the first swing. Oh, jeez. I'll go first, Clem. He's trying to, he's trying to be brave for the girl. Run up, but not too long. If you take too many quick steps, you'll propel yourself upward instead of out. Same with your jump. Just 
Run off the end, don't leave. David, Try not to. He's got this. She's right. I do. <laughs> Careful, dude. Listen with your. Listen. listen. Think with your brain, not with your dick. <laughs> Done. Come on, Clem. Your turn. <clears throat> nice. For the record, I do not trust this thing. Not at all. You've... It's one thing for the kids to swing across, but us? You've handled worse. You've got this. I've seen you do things that are way scarier. Okay. I can do it. Yeah, put a little false hope into her if that's what it takes. <laughs> there we go. Alright, David. You're up. <laughs> you're the little brother. You should go first. Oh, you're definitely lighter. <laughs> Age before beauty. Ah, oh, come on, you know the drill. Age before beauty. <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, that dipped pretty low. Didn't care for that. Oh, piss. And halfling is the problem. Hobby! Like I expected. Hobby! Oh, hang on. Okay, looking for looking for my cue. Oh fuck you. No. Oh, move the left stick to, to Oh oh I see. I think I fucked up. I think I'm gonna get eaten. Oh really? Oh nice! Get it. Be careful, it's not dead. Oh, nice. You okay? Uh, no turning back. Um, just like we planned. Good work, everyone. Just like we rehearsed. I don't know. I think we can do better. Head back over. Let's try that again. Enough. <laughs> Come on. Enough. Piss off, David. Almost there. Nice. Did it. That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you, and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game.